Hey ups everybody, in today's video we're going to be talking about how to notice when you're in a cycle. But ultimately... So in life things work in cycles. Information throughout nature informing life forms to grow. You know, when I look at my bonsai tree, which I've grown for years, it's never been the same set of leaves. It's never been the same set of leaves that it started off with. It's gone through cycles. It's gone through seasons. It's gone through changes. As the trunk grew thicker and the branches grew longer, the leaves changed and it shedded itself. We are getting affected by the same energetical effects that nature does. You know, if you're aware of it or not, you are going through cycles too. You are going through changes too. And it's important to become aware of this. It's important to become um, aware of your level of understanding of yourself and how your habits and functions work and your brain patterns work. So how you are, how life has taught you to be so far, or your upbringing, um, your trauma or your experiences you've been through up until this stage in your life has formed certain habitual and psychological patterns in your brain and it's good to become so aware of yourself and I'm going to tell you for why. It's good to become so aware of yourself in this way is because when we're going through cycles and changes, sometimes we feel lost and confused. We feel a bit, you know, displaced. We don't know where we are. We don't know who we are. We don't know how to feel because there's different things going on in his life and we don't know where our standpoint is. We don't know where our centre is. And it's about finding that base within yourself so you can approach life in the right way. Going through cycles, going through changes... When you're feeling lost and confused, sometimes it's just about realising where you're at. Life will up uh, often, life, I've found in my own personal life, it will offer you opportunities similar to what you've already been through. And it's a test. It's a test to see if you've outgrown your environment, if you've outgrown the situations that you've been through. You know, it works in a cycle. Things come back round. People or similar, similar situations come back round and it's life's way of testing you to see if you've outgrown that certain stage in your life. There's things you can think about right now where you've met somebody in a similar sort of fashion to a previous situation you've been through or you've started a job and you've got a boss that's similar to a boss you've already had. You know, there's, there's similar situations and similar synchronicities that happen within life that are tests to see if you've outgrown, that if you're ready to step and do something different other than what you did last time. It's important to notice the cycles in life and realise that you're going through a process. If you're focused on being a better version of yourself and evolving as an individual, growing as an individual, you're going to go through stages, you're going to go through hardship, you're going to go through tough points in life. The biggest commitments, the toughest choices and, you know, the hardest of sufferings offering often reap the biggest rewards. You know, the tough choices we have to make in life, the most significant staple moments in our lives is what calves us as an individual. It's what calves us and steers the choices and decisions we actually make. When we go through difficulty, we learn more about ourselves, we learn more about our coping mechanisms, we learn more about how we deal with things, we learn what we don't like, what we don't want to happen again. And then ultimately stepping forwards, you know, you're going to a you're going to life with a different mindset, with a different, more sculpted approach, with a more educated and mature mindset towards your life. You know, sometimes we have to shed the old. And the old is what's keeping us where we are, not allowing us to move. It's familiar, it's comfortable. And then if we do shed the old and we do shed a skin and we cleanse ourselves and we think, right, I'm going to go with a new mindset and start reinventing myself, which is good, you know, it's growth, changing yourself. You are meant to change, you are meant to evolve. Nature goes through seasons all the time. We are meant to do the same. We are meant to be changing and evolving as life goes on. You know, 
Old gets replaced with new. The old keeps us set back and the new takes us forwards. So it's not constantly feeling like I've got to change myself, I've got to be, you know, doing something new. You know, it's not about that. It's just about growth. And it's about, am I living the best I could possibly be? If that answer is no, then why? And asking yourselves the right questions. If you're feeling lost and confused, ask yourself the right questions, you know? Am I doing everything that I should be doing in life? Am I doing everything that I need to be doing to make my life better? When you're genuinely wanting to push yourself forwards, your mind will have the answers for you. You just have to quiet down yourself and listen to what you have to say for yourself. You know, sometimes we get lost with everything that's going on around us and we're not focused on what, what our actual wants and needs are. Fundamentally, we can all change for the better for ourselves and those around us. So if you're focused on growth, if you're focused on evolving as an individual and bettering yourself, do realise you're going to go through cycles and changes. Some things are going to feel uncomfortable. Some things aren't going to feel nice. Things around you may change drastically. You know, your physical appearance may change because your whole mindset's changed. So sometimes on the other side of the cliff top, when you're just about to jump, you know, it's paradise. So make sure you keep pushing yourself. Make sure you keep making your life better, not only for yourself, but for those around you. Make yourself a better person. Be nicer to be around. Be kinder. Say kinder words. And if you're feeling lost and confused, you may just be in a cycle. You may just be up until the precipice of growth, like the, the, the caterpillar and the catalyst, and going into a butterfly. So, you know, look at the processes of life, look at the processes of yourself, and come to a lot more level of understanding, and you will make your life better. All my videos are orientated around the state of mind and mindfulness and... I don't know, it's not your run-of-the-mill YouTube videos, but I hope you've taken something away from it. I hope you've understood maybe something about your, yourself and your current situations, or maybe you're going to start looking at, into yourself and your current situations and making it better for yourself. That's what my videos are orientated about. Obviously, I love expressing my ideas onto film and putting them on YouTube, but ultimately, my ultimate goal is for people to watch this, get something from it, and make their own lives better. It's not just about watching me and getting a few ideas go actually do the work go invest in yourself and invest time into yourself and you will make your better better life in, entirely so yeah man if you're in a cycle if you're going through changes don't feel swamped under keep your head above water learn what life's trying to teach you life will teach you the lessons and the valuable things for you to get the answers sometimes you're in an information stage and you've just got to accept that life's giving you a whole load of bullshit for you to get through suffering bad things happening but it's ultimately teaching you the necessary lessons to create a better more substantial life so yeah man Hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Make sure you stay tuned. I'm going to start making more videos uh, orientated about this stuff. Um, I've gone through a lot of processes in my own life. I've been very busy in my own life. Um, that's why I haven't sat down and made a video for a good couple of months now. Um, but yeah, I'm back in business. <laughs>